to help. 
help others. So did you know that the Young Living, that Young Living, the company, pays for all of the administrative fees and staff salaries of the foundation so that every penny that you give goes directly to projects that you choose that help protect and empower some of our world's most marginalized people. That's how Gary wanted it. Because as I heard him say many times, he created each product for what? A purpose, not a profit. So knowing that when you purchase chemical-free products to clean your home with, supplements and oils to support the health of your family with, you are also supporting communities around the world with well-paying jobs in healthy environments while also fighting poverty and empowering kids and adults alike. You are a major catalyst in fueling the life-changing work of the Young Living Foundation. That is powerful. That is a story worth telling. So here are three points that I want you to walk away with so you are equipped to make a difference with your team through the foundation. First off, volunteer. This year, the foundation will capture the impact made globally through donations, but also see the impact that you, our Young Living members, are having in our local communities. We want you to find as many opportunities as possible to get out and give back together. So this One Tribe t-shirt was created specifically for you and your teams across the globe to wear when you are serving around your communities. Making service and volunteering an integral part of your team can strengthen your business. It is very important to me to positively make a difference in the lives of families. So that has been something that I've created in our team, a culture of serving others, not just getting together to eat or learn in a class with our friends and members, although that is all great and necessary, but also to serve alongside each other, to build relationships within and across our teams. I believe there's no better way to build bonds with someone than to serve with them, to experience something life-giving and selfless together. One example of our local team members serving together here in Dallas, Texas, is working with a great organization called Feed My Starving Children, or FMSC. This great organization feeds a million meals a day to starving kids all over this world. And the way those meals get packed and boxed is by volunteers. So when we got a permanent FMSC meal packing site here in Dallas about a year and a half ago, I reserved a Saturday for YL and FMSC day to have just our Young Living members come and pack together. It's a total family affair as kids from five and up can pack together. So we had some of our great leaders together with about 400 of our local members with their friends and families, uh, some young living members, some not, uh, but we participated in four different packing sessions. We had oily giveaways and vitality oils for all the winning tables and everybody got an Inkster Red packet and it was so fun. So not only did we have a wonderful time building relationships with one another in each two hour session, but we packed over 100,000 meals and paid for 342 kids to be fed in Haiti for an entire year. What a tangible way for our people to see that there is so much more to Young Living than just our products, that we care deeply about giving back and making an impact in our communities. Other group service ideas that you might be thinking of can be planting trees, community trash pickup, serving your local homeless shelter, home fix-it projects for someone in need, feeding homeless dogs and cats, or giving your time at the SBCA. The ideas are endless, and your local news may just want to highlight those good efforts too, right? Wouldn't that be fun? But no matter what the service, we encourage you to wear these t-shirts, snap a picture of you and your team giving back to your community, and then when you post those pictures online, be sure to use the hashtag YLServes, then tag the Young Living Foundation. Our foundation can't wait to highlight you and your team and our service as a one tribe in this world. This whole convention has been about one. This is the moment to come together, 
to start a movement where we show up for each other, for those on our teams and those in need globally and locally. It started with the launch of our One Heart Oil Blend and now the introduction of the One Tribe t-shirt. I can't wait to wear this at our next service activity this year. So we're gonna rock these t-shirts while we're serving together and enjoy answering the questions of onlookers. What is YL Serves? What does One Tribe mean? People in our communities will recognize us as being part of something bigger and doing good is contagious. Small groups of people engaging in action change lives. It changes businesses and it changes the world. So remember to go serve while you're wearing your shirt, tag the foundation and use our hashtag YLServes so in your posts we can celebrate you. Which brings me to the second way to connect with the foundation, social media. Do you follow the Young Living Foundation on social media? If you want to learn of the ongoing impact of the foundation and be equipped with powerful content to share, make sure you're following the foundation on Instagram and Facebook. The posts are inspiring and uplifting and make me proud to be a Young Living member. So you can make sharing fun too. Come up with unique ideas and ways to share about the impact of the foundation as well as the impact your team is having locally. One idea could be to encourage your team to start Foundation Friday, where you all share your favorite posts that highlight the global impact of the foundation and then the local impact that your team is having. Sharing through social media will show that Yum Living is more than an essential oil company. It's a company that does great things in the world. People love sharing the good they're involved in, and this gives you and your team more visibility. Sharing your generosity can inspire others and will. We are all about duplication in Young Living. So let's duplicate your great ideas by sharing them and spreading those out into every country. Now, the third way to have a bigger impact, global impact, through the Young Living Foundation is simply by encouraging your team members to round up their orders. Rounding up, that means a penny to maximum 99 cents. And in the US alone, if everyone rounded up each order, we could collectively give over $300,000 every single month to providing access to quality education, rescuing kids being exploited, empowering women by teaching skills that lead to meaningful jobs so that they can now feed and protect their families. Did you know that this year, just in the month of March, and just by rounding up, that we all raised nearly $110,000 for the foundation in just one month. So thank you for that. That is enough to test, treat, and educate over 20,000 people for malaria, or help nearly 850 mothers start a small business to help their children stay safe or provide education to 2,200 children in Uganda and Ethiopia and Cambodia. So this is the story I want you to hear and that I want you to tell your members because it will help them fall more in love with Young Living, just like you and I have. For our international members, you too can still get involved by donating directly to the youngliveingfoundation.org. Even $1 that can come out of your debit card automatically each month can and will save lives. I am a big advocate of leading by example, whether it is by product usage, business building, or giving, and I don't expect my team members to do or to give something that I'm not willing to do. If you want to increase the impact for good with all of your members, it starts with you leading by example. Not because it's good for business, not for public recognition, but because it's the right thing to do. So I want you to be the grassroots movement on your team and for your team. You will inspire others to serve, to give back, and to join your team. To find community and like-mindedness and servant hearts. I mean, who doesn't want to be with community and world changers? Broaden your life's purpose and find what fuels your passions. Wherever you are feeling led to give or serve, I want to encourage you to go and do that. You will find camaraderie and loyalty to your tribe and to Young Living like never before. This has been my experience and I think you will find the same. So, 
round up, volunteer together, share your stories with the Young Living Foundation, and be creative in what you love to do and how you can use it to share and help others. Your time, money, and efforts will go far beyond your walls, far beyond your current members and your business to launch you into this next decade of wellness, purpose, and abundance. I'm gonna turn this over now to my friend, fellow Foundation board member and Royal Crown Diamond in Canada, Ben Howden. Ben's traveled the world with Gary, his members, and the Young Living Foundation. So thank you all, and thank you, Ben. Carry on. Thank you, Danette, for sharing your heart and experience with us. Like Danette mentioned, my name is Ben Howden, and me and my wife, Carol, started our journey with Young Living in 1999. I had a chance to work and serve and learn from Gary himself, stretching back to the creation of the Young Living Foundation. Some of my best memories was learning from Gary in his home, like we do when we hold classes in our homes. These in-home classes are intended to educate people in Young Living. That includes the products, the healthy lifestyle, the company's history, and how Young Living and its members give back. This foundation doesn't belong to a board and it doesn't belong to management. It belongs to you, the members. I had so many people come to me and say how much they love the foundation, but they don't know how to share with their friends and their families and their members. We have three simple points that we can talk about. First, the first is simply sharing what the foundation does. During general session, our New Executive Director Jackie Skinner shared the Foundation's new mission and three pillars, and now it makes much easier for us to talk about, and we love it. The, the new mission to empower and protect our world's young, along with the new pillars, champion education and exploitation and develop enterprise, were created with you in mind, so you can easily and concisely share what the Foundation does with family, friends, and your downlines. These are really easy to remember. Three E's, education, exploitation, and enterprise. One great way to bring your team together is to make, and make a big impact is by creating a fundraiser in support of, your, of the Young Living Foundation in your group. I have had wonderful experiences with my team joining together to make this impact. When we were in Ecuador for Platinum Retreat, Gary announced that the Academy needed to add a high school to the property so kids could finish their schooling there. Gary told us it would be $100,000 for the complete edition. And on the last day at the farewell dinner, some of us made up donation forms. And we went around to the tables and we talked about how leaders, we can make a difference. And in one hour, we raised $37,500 for the new high school. Gary was so excited and so was our team. He said, we can start building tomorrow. As a Young Living community, we each were one for someone, and I felt so proud to impact. As a Young Living community, we each were one for someone, and we felt so proud of the impact we were able to make. Fundraising as a team is just one way to create unity among our team and to make a huge impact. There are some excellent examples on the Foundation website of past fundraising, both individual and team fundraisers. Check out and see if ideas in the past spark some fun ideas for the future. With a team fundraiser, individual members of your team can hold their own fundraiser. And you can track who is bringing in the most donations and potentially reward them. Make it fun and make it engaging. Second, you can share the foundation theme of this year and explain it, what it means to you. And this year's theme is Be One for Someone. This is a great conversation starter to get to know those on your team. You can ask who in their lives has been there for them specifically, or how do they want to be one for someone else. With this year's theme comes our Be One For Someone fundraiser campaign, which is to become a monthly donor in the amount of $11 per month. $11 a month is the average amount of a monthly streaming service subscription cost like Netflix, Amazon Prime, Spotify, Apple Music, we all, and others, we all use some of those. We enjoy these things because they benefit our lives. But becoming one for someone, you can make a difference in another person's life. 
your monthly donation of to this foundation is like a subscription, but this one is all about empowering others to give back. One is symbolic of being one for another. And we can join us in becoming a monthly donor in the amount of $11 a month. We want to build a community of givers like we've never seen in Young Living before. Most of us can give $11 a month. Some of us can give more. But whatever you give, 100% goes directly to the lifting the lives of a vulnerable, vulnerable child. Third, if you need any support in creating a fundraiser online, the foundation can support you through this and is very responsive via email. You can reach them at info at younglivingfoundation.org for fundraising support. This is your foundation. Here's your chance and your challenge. Be a leader for others and go be one for someone. Your local communities and global communities are counting on you. Thank you. We are